Well, I was asking for some recommendations for Canadian comedy and one of my viewers recommended this and told me I might find it quite funny because it's related to Scotland. So this is from Royal Canadian Air Force, which I've actually watched a few clips from before and I like it, great show. And this one's called The Macintoshy, so that does sound like quite a Scottish name to be honest, but it could be just as easily Canadian as well, a lot of names like that in Canada. Uh, so yeah, interested about to see this. Tell me more about Royal Canadian Air Force if you have like a favourite sketch from that show. Uh, tell me about that and I'll maybe try and find it. Uh, but yeah, let's watch this one first and enjoy. <laughs> Somewhere in Scotland today. Looks like a little cottage that could be in Scotland and yeah, we hear the bagpipes there as well. Son, we were worried. Where have you been? Mother, father, I'm in love. <gasps> well, what's wrong with that? Get it out of your mind, son. Things like this can happen on a lonely crofter's farm in the windswept islands. Go out and mix with people again. Ah, you've been too long among the sheep. <laughs> I'm in love with a human person. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Already, like, the stereotype of people from the highlands is quite accurate, I would say. Tell me about the actors and actresses. Are any of them from Scotland? I mean, they're quite good Scottish accents. I, I really probably couldn't tell the difference, honestly, so this is quite good. Oh, goodness. Praise <laughs> me. And which member of her clan is she? Uh, she's not from our clan. She want to marry outside the clan? No male member of our family has ever married outside the clan. Oh, no? What about Kevin? All right, let me rephrase that. No male member of our family has ever married a woman outside the clan. <laughs> Which clan is she from, son? Her name's Mary. Her father is of the Innes clan. Her mother's a Buchanan. And her grandsire was a McTavish. The dreaded Innes Buchanan McTavish clan? You can't marry her. <laughs> Why not? Because they're the IBMs. <laughs> and we are the Macintoshes. <laughs> So wait, was this like a running sketch that was throughout this show as well? If so, I'll need to try and look out for more. I love it, man. The accent is so spot on. I like the way they roll the R as well. I definitely do that. So this is a great one, man. You'll never be compatible. Oh, but mother, she's the apple of me eye. <laughs> These mixed marriages done a work, son. You're a Macintosh through and through. Those IBMs are too complicated. We Macintosh are just plug and play. What the? <laughs> so is it like Apple Macintosh and IBM, like the computer companies as well? The IBMs have DOS. VOS is DOS. VOS is DOS. <laughs> Keep that for the German skits. <laughs> <laughs> it can't work, son. She'd be frightened the minute you took out your mouse. <laughs> You won't be able to interface. She doesn't have the expansion slots that you have. <laughs> but she's got a bodacious pair of peripherals. <laughs> All right, I didn't want to say it, but it's well known that family's got a virus. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> Would you want your children with fuzzy logic? <laughs> you mean garbage in, garbage out? <laughs> ah. Then I'll have to give her up. But I don't care what you say, I'm not staying here. Never again will I live in a house without windows. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one, that is good. Then what'll you do? I'll do what we Scots have always done. I'll go out and get drunk. And then I'll emigrate <laughs> to a place where a lad and a lass can meet and marry where there are jobs and young people can have a future free of old world prejudice. And where's that? Canada. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, Jamie. Will he find a good lass in Canada? I hope so, Fiona, because he sure as hell won't find any jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. So at that time, was there like a lack of jobs in Canada? That's a brilliant one, man. I love it. Like, even just... The Scottish impression, the like uh, the location and things, all very good. But the 
the like analogy of the two computer companies at that time at IBM, Apple Macintosh. I mean, even thinking about Apple being called Apple Macintosh, that's why it took a little minute to actually figure out what was going on. But uh, yeah, very, very clever writing, very funny. I love it, man. I love to see like other com countries do comedy about Scotland or related to Scotland. That actually makes me a bit proud. Uh, and yeah, I'm. I think like I'm like the same as most Scottish people. We love to like get the piss taken out of us and like do different things. But this was very fair, man. This is a good one. Uh, tell me what you think about it. Again, tell me if there was any other Macintosh family sketches in this show, or tell me if you know any other Canadian comedy about Scotland. Thanks.